Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm just going to show you some items that I've been getting over the last couple of weeks. Uh, I've got quite a collection of different things, so I thought I would do a YouTube video on them. Um, now, I've got gel polishes, I've got glitter bells, I've got dipping powders, glitters, and some chrome pigments, I think they are. So I'll just show you a few at a time because there is quite a lot of products that I've got so first of all I think I'll show you the glitter bells now I have just uploaded a video of me doing swatches of the glitter bells um, products I'm just making sure it I'm in focus. Right, um, the recent ones I've bought, I have been getting a nice little collection of these now. I think I've got about 50 pots and I've only been buying them since, I think it's about September. Now, I do buy some from Glitter Bells. I buy from A and A Glitters. I also buy them from Glitterati. I think Blue Street Crystal sells them as well. So if you can't get a certain colour on Glitterbell's website, try the others, because that's where I've been doing. Um, I do want Barbie candy, but I can't seem to get my hands on it. And I think it was Flamingo Feather or something, and our Peacock one. There was a Peacock one, it wasn't Flamingo Feather. That was a pink one, I've got that one. I think it was a Peacock one. Um, I can't get hold of them. So... These are the newest ones that I've got. Like I said, I have got about 50 of them, but I think nine of them are upstairs and I can't have them until Christmas. Well, it's my birthday five days before Christmas and my wedding anniversary, so I have to work then. So these are the ones that I've got to show you right now. Um, there's no point me opening them up and showing yet because if you want to see what these colours look like, just go and have a look at my previous video. Because I'm oh, stabbing this with me nails. Because I've literally just uploaded it. So that's the glitter bells. But I'll move them to one side. And I'll just quickly show you the swatches that I've just done. Now that one's lava lamp. I've been trying to get loads of different colours, orange crush. So even though Christmas is coming, I've still got like the odd client that likes orange and pinks. Pink pony. Unicorn crush. I do have quite a few of the crushes now. Fish food. And rainbow crush. So they're the ones that I've just done in my previous video. So that's those. And now I've been sent these different powders from um, Model One. So I'm assuming Azure or Azure is another company that Model One's on. And these are different colour, different powders. I don't even think I've opened them yet. I'm, I am waiting for the glue and the activator oh god how come you can never open anything with your nails on and I don't want to oh yeah it's opening these are 10 gram pots so if you do buy the old nail pots they were 7 grams so it'll give you a fair idea so like I said I haven't even tried these I haven't opened these so I will have to do a video on these. I'll probably just do them on some swatch sticks though because like I said, I've just done my nails recently. I've never used dip powders before, but I have seen a few videos. So you look, they're still sealed. Let's see if I can go into it. Ooh. Oh God. I don't want to cave it in. I'm just looking for something now I can prod into it to get it out. Without, there we are, I'm getting it all over. 
so it'll be just as fine as acrylic powders now I did watch a video where someone used these I think it was a girl from America I can't remember her name and I don't know if it was these colours that she that she actually used I think it was the brighter ones but she did say she did try using them with monomer to see if you could use them just as acrylic because as you all know I'm an acrylic nail technician and she said they went on um, like patchy marbly with you could see the white so I think she did say that they do have a lot of white pigment in them so she doesn't recommend using them for acrylic but I think I will have a go and just see what it actually does look like but that's a pack of 10 four six or ten yeah that's a pack of ten um like i say i will do a separate video on giving those a bash to see how well they go with dipping like i said i've never used dip powders before so if anyone's got any hints or tips before i do it um just comment down below so that was those i've bought some glitters i got that one a little sample free i mean like that that's a sample of glitter i mean what are you supposed to do with that do you know what i mean like you wouldn't even go on a nail so unless it's just in a bag just to show you like what 0 0.004 for holographic dark pink looks like which i'm assuming that's it i know it's a free sample but if you You've got to just be looking at that to see what it actually looked like in real life because you couldn't do anything with that amount in there, could you? So that'll probably not get used. I think that's a bit of a waste of time myself. Like, anyway, um, Kylie uh, Worry, if anybody follows her on YouTube, she did do a video with the glitter bells and it was absolutely gorgeous. And I know she uses glitters from Glitterati, and it was like, oh, that video is brilliant them nails are lush i want to do this i want to recreate this i don't have all the colors that she used but i've got some nail colors that are similar so these are the ones i mean they're absolutely gorgeous so that's holographic silver holographic lilac i mean they are stunning like i can't bulk it right and that one is lavender. I do get a subscription every month from the Glitter Fairy. I think it's gone up to £5.40 now. Um, I do like Smiley's glitters. That's Sarah from Smiley Glitter Star. Air glitters are fabulous. I've never had any complaints. She even made me you know, my own custom mix-up last year for me wedding anniversary nails and my birthday nails. So if you don't know Smiley's Glitter Star, Go and check her out. I think I do have some videos there from a while ago. So just go back. Oh, God, a few months on my channel and you'll see them. I got this one from Glitterati and it's Mermaid Sequins Purple. So I've just put GA. I put this in this pot because it did come in a bag. And that's those. I mean, they're beautiful. I'm sure I've seen them on a video and I was like, I'm buying them. So, I'm just making sure the lid's on properly because I don't want it to leak all over my drawer. And I also got these little galaxy stars. Now, Kylie, where he did a video using these, like I said, and she did the normal, just the five stars. But I've got some of those that are like cut out in the center and i fancied these ones so i haven't even opened them yet so no doubt they'll probably spill i mean look at that that last you for ages it's only a little pot but look how many you get they're gorgeous so i thought i'm going to recreate the design but using these stars instead of look see look they're all over i knew i knew that would happen but, I mean, for what you get, what you get in there, and I'm trying not to waste anything. I mean, you can't go wrong. 
I think it cost me ten pound. I think it was ten pound, ten pound and pennies for postage and for those. And I think I got those at the same time. So I think I got a lot for ten pound. I don't think I got them in separate orders. I think they all came in one. But like I said, I, I am on a subscription with the Glitter Fairy. Now, you do get, it's like VIP and you get four different types of bundles and you don't know what bundle you're going to get in the post. And you get a code, which I can't show it on the back of this packet. And you go on a website, you type the code in and it'll show you someone recreating a set using these. Now this was a, this is a super fine mix of the video that they showed me. The only thing I was disappointed was it just showed you using these in a gel polish design. Whereas I'm more acrylic, so I wish they'd have done one for gel polish and one for acrylic. But this came in a bag, but I didn't want to be pouring it in one of those little triangle trays and pouring it back into the bag because I thought with it being so fine, I'm going to lose a lot of it. I mean that is gorgeous. But that would be nice buffed into a gel polish. And that's the Halo Chrome Pigment. And I haven't even opened this. I have so many new products. And I haven't used them because, like I say, when I put my nails on, they last a few weeks. And I never know what to do because I've got that many things. So that's the Silver Hollow. So I'll have to give that a bash. I'll do that on some gel polishes one day and I'll show you, but I, I'm sure you can buy these on the Glitter Fairy website. So that's from, you can, you can find these groups on Facebook. That's Miss Lucy and the Glitter Fairy. She's on Facebook. And that was the mix. So that was November, 2019 mix I got these from eBay now I got these a while back and like I said I've still never used them I think the chrome pigments I think obviously from Barn Pretty Yeah, it's definitely a crumb. You don't get much in there, like, do you? I mean, I know it's going to go a long way, but... And with it being off eBay, it'll have been probably a Chinese seller, Chinese company. So, see, look. I haven't even opened it. I think I bought these because I've seen some nail. Oh God, I can't even get in the bag. I want to cut it open. I've seen some nail tutorials and the companies that you can buy, say the chromes and things from. Like, charge your fortune. And I thought, stuff that, I'm going on eBay. I'm going on eBay, see if I can get something similar. Because it does the same job. And that's the only, where they get theirs from, so. So I'm sure that's like a chameleon one. That looks like it's going to go up purple. Ooh. But that's gorgeous. Like I hope you can see this properly with this light. So that's that one. And this one. Is up. That one's up in there. This one. Oh, I wonder if there are other ones like a greeny blue one. This one's purple. Oh, like it's like a gold and purple. That's gorgeous. Oh, God, I hope you can see that. That is nice. That'll be nice and black gel polish. 
So I'll have to do some vampy nails and more for my pastels, but I'm going to have to um, go out my comfort zone and do something else. Right, these gel polishes uh, from eBay. Just type in RS nails and the 15 grams. Now I bid it on these on eBay individually and I think I ended up paying just over a pound for each one. I think they're about three pound each or three fifty each if you want to buy them. Like I said, there's 15 grams in the bottles and they're absolutely brilliant. I'll give it a shake and I'll show you what colours. This one is 185. They are, like, I can't fault this brown brand. So, there's that one. I'm just hoping my light's not... I'll leave it like that. So, that's 185. This is 076, I'll give it a shake. But these are absolutely gorgeous, look at that. They go on like a dream, they've never ever bubbled. 155. Like, I really, really can't fault this company. Um, they're that good. I use their top coat and base coat. I did used to use Neos. I think it's Urban Graffiti. And it was like £15 a bottle. But when I was getting it before, I think I got them in the sale for something like 3 or £4 a bottle. So I bought two a while back. And I mean, about two years ago. And then they were £15. And I'm like, I'm not paying that. Now that's 100. That's more of like a salmon -y pink. I thought there's no way I'm paying that much. So, because these were so good, zero, zero, 001, I thought I'm going to try the top coat and the base coat, and it's fab. See, black. But no, like, if you want to go on eBay, just type in RS nail to 290. Just buy one and see how you go with it. That's a glittered one. That's like a rose gold. That's nice. That'll probably be nice over the pink or even over a black. This one is 067. That's a nice pink. Until I like my pinks, can you? And this one's 296. Sorry, give it a shake. And that's like a silvery one. I'm sure with that one, and um, one of them pink ones came as a set. But that's how the top coat comes. And that's how the base coat Comes. Now you can buy them on their own or you can buy them as a set. But I bid it on these and I think I only paid about £2 and that was for the pair. So if you see them, bid on them because you always get them cheaper when you bid on these rather than buying them outright. But I've left these in the boxes because I've still got a full bottle of each up, up there. And like I say, I really, really can't fault them. So even if you bid it on them, got them as a set for about two pounds, and gave them a go. I mean, you can't you can't go wrong. And if you don't like them, use them on your swatch sticks. I mean, for fifteen mil size bottles as well. Like it's fab. But I use them all the time, and I use them on my clients, and I use them on myself, and I've never had no problems. Right, another thing I forgot to show you is. Glitterbell's brought the Dappen dish out. Now, I've used the little jam jars, the little tiny ones. I'll, I think I've got one in here. I'll show you one of these. I mean, I've bought, um, you know, like little candle holders because they're weighted. I've used them and 
I thought I wanted something with a lid on and I was using this and this was fab. So now I've just put like a bit of brush clean on it now. And I got this and I think, I think, oh look, star in the bottom now. I think this, this is 12.50. It's perfect. Like, I'll just show you. This is just me, um, my nail mitt magic stick. It's a bit battered now. I mean, it's perfect because it gets right in, like proper in. When you're wiping your brush on the side, it's weighted so it doesn't tip. Like I was having to use my jar, I was putting my brush in and I was having to hold my jar. Like say you've got this hand busy, or you're holding your client's hand. The last thing you want to be doing is leaving God to grab your jar while you're doing this, to go back to what you're doing. You want to be able to stay as you are, pick your brush up, do that, wipe it on the side, dip it in and carry on. And with this, I can do that and it's got glitter bells in the bottom. But I'm sure this is £12.50 and I got it when I got me three of me colours and it's lovely and weighted. You've got your little lid on it. It looks lovely on your table and it's the best step and dish or best dish that I've used for me acrylic liquid. It's I can't I can't rate it enough, it's fab. So if you're struggling for a dapping dish that's weighted, that's not going to move that. You're not going to have to grab all of it every time you're doing someone's nails. Buy one of them. Because the fab. And these, I don't know if I posted a picture on my Instagram of these a few weeks ago. I got some Model Ones products to review. And I got a cord. There was like a little card and it said... Thank you for being our customer, blah, 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 blah. Um, here's a discount code. And it was for, I think it was for one of the aqua gels. I'm just going to have a look and see if I can find one of them. Right, I wanted to buy, I wanted one of these. So I bought this, I think it was about £10 for the clear. Because I want to do some poly nail gels. That I can encapsulate some glitter in, some clear on it. So I'm going to play about that sometime. Like I say, there's all sorts that I need to do. And it's just finding time to do it. So anyway, there was a cord and it said, Oh, take this cord in to Google and you can have a free poly nail gel. So I thought, oh, fab, I'll get another one of these. So the cord took me to a Model 1 site and whoever I spoke to says, yeah, we'll send you the code tomorrow. You can type it in Amazon and type in this discount code and you'll get it for free. But obviously, you've got to pay for your postage. Then the next day, I got another message saying, oh, we're out of stock, but she want one of these nail gel parcels instead. So I thought, oh, great. Yeah, I've already got me clear poly gel. That lasts me ages. I'll have one of these. So... I paid the postage myself. Let me see if I can open it. And I got these. I'm not going to open the box now. I got these. And I mean, little, little diddy pots. I think they're eight mils. But they're perfect if, like, they're not good for clients because you wouldn't get, like, or you could use money client, but you probably only get one set of nails out of them. But the perfect is a stocking filler for like a teenager. So I'll just quickly show you what colours I got in them. There's that one. I mean, I haven't even I haven't even swatched them. I don't want to swatch them because I think by the time I swatch them, they've been out left. So if you've got a teenager or someone, I mean, considering I had to pay postage. I know, because I'm not on Amazon Prime. I was before, and I was alright faff on with getting things off them. So now I just pay for me, me delivery. But when you order over £20, you get free delivery anyway. So I ordered this, and I ordered something else, and I ordered something else to get me order over £20. So I didn't even pay the postage. So that's, that's, not, that's like a pinky, can you say that? It's like a pinky, creamy, white. Because I thought, if you're paying postage, you're not really getting it for free. So I thought, I'll order something else and get get me postage free. 
that's grey. This one, oh, that's like a brown. So, like I said, I wouldn't even wear swatching these. I might even give them to my daughter for Christmas because I bought her a gel lamp. That's a darker grey. And she's only got little ditty fingers. This one, that's a nice pink. I like that one. See, I know these are the deeper colours. That's a purple. I'm hoping you can see these. Oh, oh God, I can't even open them. That's a darker purple. Beautiful colours. So I thought, well, I've already got the poly gel, the big tube. May as well get something else. Pink. So if you get any cards in with any of your products, like, use them. Use your, use your cards. That's a darker purple. I mean, I did do one the other week. And it was, yeah, we'll send you a code within seven days. And I never heard anything again. So I thought, well, I'm not going to bother chasing it up. That's... See, that's not quite white. It's really, really, really light grey. See, I don't know if I've done that one. I think I did. I think it's just rolled back over. Yeah, I did. Oh. And this one is... Oh. Oh, and that's like a silvery... No, it's more of a gold. Yeah, that's more of a gold one. So that must be like a topper one. So yeah, that's that's where I got basically for free. Right guys, I think that's everything. Watch there we are. I think that's everything I've had recently. Um like I said, I have got loads of the glitter bells I can show you. I did only show the planet collection last time with swatches. But if you want to see the other colours, I can do. I have used the Monomer for the first time the other day on my nails. I did use... I got this new glue. Because when I done my room to it, I did say that I was using this nail one. I mean, these are only 99p and they're absolutely fabulous. If you want to use a cheap glue to do your nails and you buy from nail stock up on these i stocked up on them i must have had about 10 15 of them and now i've got none left and i don't want to go all the way to nail i mean it's a half an hour drive but i've converted over to glitter bells so i don't really want to be putting an order in paying delivery or going all the way to nail just for some glue so i thought i'll give this a bash now i use it to stick my tips on and i had no problems and I used it to stick my gems on. I didn't with our hand. I used a different glue. So I thought I'd use it on this hand. And they've not gone anywhere. Like I used it there and I used it there as well. I did do that and I thought, oh, no, I can use my glitter bells for that. And apparently I seen on someone's video, was it Dizzy's Nails? Pardon me if I've got it wrong. I'm sure she said you can use this for dipping. I have put a comment on her video and I've asked her to say she'll do a video to show me because if you can't, I think I'll give this a bash with the different powders that I've got. Anyway guys, um, thanks for watching my video. Um, I have gone from like 50 subscribers to 90 something so I really, really appreciate those who've liked and subscribed and shared my videos. I'm sorry, me giveaway is only for UK. Um, I was hoping to get up to 300, but I think I'm being a bit unrealistic as to get 300 at the minute. So I may change it to say like 150 
and hopefully get it done by the new year. If I can get 150 by the new year, I'll be happy and I'll do my giveaway early for 150 subscribers. And if I can get 150 by the end of the year, I'll do the giveaway, what I've already showed you the video, what I'm giving away, and I think I'll do just a little giveaway of some brand new makeup because I always buy doubles in case I run out and the doubles that I've bought it doesn't even look like I'm going to run out the first one I've got so please carry on sharing my channel and I need to do some makeup ones as well I'm just finding time so anyway I don't want to blabber on and bore you my video has gone on for half an hour which before and usually kicks me off with by now but I've deleted some rubbish off it anyway guys Thanks for subscribing again, like and share my video and I hope to see you in the next one. Thank you, bye.